to grow plants on any object in Unreal Engine 5.4. Let's get into it. First, let's download some free assets on Quixel Bridge. I chose this Roman statue, clovers, and grass clumps. Drag the statue into your level and change the location values all to zero. Do the same with the plants. The plants are too large, Let's change the scale value to 0.1. Now let's go to Motion Design. If you don't see this option, simply go to Edit, Plugins, and select Motion Design. You will need to restart the engine. Go to Motion Design, Actors, Cloner Actor, and then click in your level. Also change the location and scale values to zero to match the statue better. Then delete the default cube. Now select the plants, make it movable, and move it under the cloner. Make sure the cloner is selected and under details go to layout name and change it from grid to mesh. Then select the eyedropper tool and click on your statue. A weird thing happens and some textures go missing. To fix this, simply add a one behind the Z location value. You should see your texture returning back to normal. Now let's add a effector. Call it effector rotate. Change it from sphere to unbound and change the Y rotation to minus 90. Go to the cloner, click the plus sign next to effector in the details panel and select the effector you just created. Change the count value to whatever you like. Create another effector, call it effector anim. Change it from sphere to plane. I changed the easing to in out cubic, but you can choose whatever. Also change the scale to zero so that it grows from nothing to whichever size you like. Go to the cloner again. Click the plus sign next to effector and add the effector anim you created. Change this effector's location value also to zero and the scale to 0.1. Now rotate it to an angle you like. Create a new sequence and add the effector anim to the sequencer. Click on the plus sign and click transform. Go to the first frame and add a keyframe, then go to the last frame and move your effector down to create the growing effect. Make a keyframe. Now press play and watch it grow. If you'd like to see more tutorials like this, please leave a comment, smash the like button, and make sure to follow me for more. Thanks. Haptic out.